What's up, people? It's Cowboy coming at you. I got something to say. Are y'all listening to me? Hello, YouTube family. What's it going, family? How y'all doing this evening, man? Hope everybody's good. Cowboy decided to step out, find some time to blow him some quick smoke. Figured I may as well just share it with y'all uh, what I'm doing tonight. Almost didn't come on, but why not? I got a cigar that I'm gonna smoke tonight that I got out of a uh, uh, provider club. Actually, my the last cigar from my June pack that I am going to smoke here this evening. It's nice and cool out, man, so I thought I'd come out and blow some smoke. Uh, tell y'all what I think about it. What we gonna smoke tonight that I pulled out of the old humidor, which is the uh, Zeno Davidoff back to back. I think this is a limited edition 2019. Um, the cigar is a pretty good looking stick, man. It's been in the humidor for a couple months now, so it's more than enough time in there for me to go ahead and smoke it. Uh, this thing's got a beautiful wrap on it. Uh, nice, slight veins on it. Just a little bit of tooth to it. Good looking cigar. Good looking roll there. Let's see what we're getting on the smell. I'm getting some must. Deep earthy note. Sweet tobacco on the foot. Chocolate maybe. Some hay. But yeah, it's a really good looking cigar, man. Very nice looking wrap on that thing. From what I understand, there's some artists out of New York who came up with this idea for this blend and this cigar. It's a really good looking stick. Balisco. Nice uh, nice cap on this thing. But what we gonna do is uh, we gonna cut him up. We gonna fire him up and we gonna smoke him up. Cowboy gonna let y'all know what I think about it. Of course, since we got that type of cap on it, straight cut is what's gonna work tonight. Not too much off the tip, just enough. Uh, perfect draw on that thing. Perfect draw right now. Got some light, light milk chocolate, I guess, on that uh, on that cool cold draw. Woody, some type of a bakery note, bagel note. Really nice draw. Good smelling cigar. Nice woodsy hay smell to that thing. So let's go ahead and fire this thing up. See what we working with. Like I say, this is from my June pack. So I got a lot of cigars to smoke. I gotta play catch up. I'm getting these cigars in fast as I can, faster than I can smoke them. But that's all right. I like to let my cigar sit in the humidor for a while before I touch them anyway. Oh yeah. Really good looking cigar. I think I failed to mention to you guys, this thing is a 7x52. Um, it's dressed in a uh, Ecuadorian Connecticut wrapper. Connecticut binder and it's got Dominican and Nicaraguan fillers in it. It's got a nice smooth draw to it so far. Got some spice coming off of there. Some pepper. Uh, not too deep on the pepper. Just a little bit. It's hard for me to tell. It's almost like a, a cayenne pepper more than it is a black pepper for me. On the retro here.
nice sweet tobacco note, even floral, nice woody note. Got some sweet there, like, uh, I don't know what kind of, almost like a, Maybe a little light sugar there on the sweetness. Maybe that's honey. Probably a little, little bit of a honey note. Picking up a really nice woody floral note off of that retro hair. Well, like I said, cayenne spice. But uh, feeling like it's about medium in body right now. But it looks like I'm going to be sitting there for a little while smoking this thing. So let me get down through the uh, first third. I'll get back with you guys and let y'all know what I think. All right, YouTube family, I'm back. Enjoying the uh, Davidoff Zeno back-to-back -back limited edition 2019 from Provider Club. Really, really nice cigar. As you can see, it's got a beautiful burn to it. Beautiful burn line there. Nice ash. Good looking stick, man. Not bad. This cigar has a uh, very nice cedar note to it. Um, it's earthy. A really nice smooth earth. Floral. I'm picking up That chocolate that I've been getting is more of a a milky, maybe a white chocolate more for me. Uh, the other sweetness that I'm getting on it is almost like a, a sweetener that you would put in a drink. It's got a nice uh, bagel, bready bakery note to it. Really good smoke. A nice, fresh... Uh, hay to it as well. It's on the low side of medium um, on the strength and I'm gonna say it's medium in body and medium in flavor right now. Perfect draw. No problems with the draw on this thing whatsoever. But the cigar is, is doing well. Um, apologize for the noise in the background. Police helicopters flying around the last few minutes. But hey, man, overall, so far, so good. Good looking stick, good smoking stick. We're going to smoke it down to the second part of it. I'll come back and let y'all know what I think. Well, you too. As you can see, the uh, Davidoff Zeno back to back limited edition 2019 is doing pretty doggone good tonight. That's a beautiful ash on that thing, man. Very nice, smooth, mellow smoking cigar. Very happy with it. Look at the burn on that thing. Have not had to touch it up one time. Beautiful, beautiful mascara line, as they call it, on that thing. As I get close to this wrapper, before I take it off, I'm gonna get close enough to it to put some heat on it so it comes off easy for me. But the cigar is smoking great. Uh, more of a mild to medium body cigar. I'm picking up a nice uh, hazelnut spread. Like, I'm getting that bagel note, that bakery bagel note, but I'm also picking up like a spread that you would put on a bagel, like a nice hazelnut creamy spread. Beautiful mouth feel. On the retro, I've been getting uh, a sweet, mild red pepper, a sweet cayenne. Uh, which is just about gone now. Uh, very good floral note on the retro here. Very smooth smoke. Good smoke coming off of that thing. Got a salty sweet nut note to it. Uh, even getting a little citrus there. I'm drinking some green tea right now. Um, but prior to drinking the green tea, I was still picking up 
what I believe to be a green tea note. Also, I'm getting like a, a vanilla Coke note on this thing as well. Very good aroma to the cigar, like a, a vanilla type of an aroma, almost like a vanilla candle or vanilla um, spray that you would spray like in the bathroom. Very nice, very smooth cigar, man. I mean, it's, do, it's doing well. It's not, it's not doing anything crazy, but it's doing just enough. It's like the cigar's on cruise control right now. Uh, like I say, mild to medium, in strength, medium in body, medium to somewhere between medium to full on the flavors. The flavors are moving around. I'm getting a few different things on it, but uh, we're going to keep smoking it down. Beautiful stick. I'll get down past the band towards the last third, come back and give y'all my final thoughts on it. All right, YouTube family, I'm back. Down to the last third on the Provider Club, the last cigar out of my Provider Club June pack. The Davidoff Zeno back to back, limited edition 2019, the 7 by 52 Balisco. Damn good smoking cigar. Very pleased with that cigar. Cigar's doing some wonderful things, man. We got down to this last third. Cigar has a very nice, rich tobacco core to it. It's creamy. Like I said, I was picking up like a, a hazelnut-like cream spread on this thing. Uh, nice floral notes on the retro hair. When we got down to this last third, the pepper began to pick back up on the retro hair. It wasn't there through the second third. It was there in the first part of the cigar, but it began to pick back up again on this last third. Starting to get a lot between the second and the last third. Some cinnamon spice, a little vanilla Coke. Uh, it has a nice creamy feel uh, to, in the mouth. Uh, as it start to get down a little bit further, it's starting to get just a little bit bitter on the end. Um, this cigar is gonna finish mild to medium in strength, medium in body, and medium in flavor. Yeah, still nice and smooth on that retro hair with a little bit of pepper. A little bit of cinnamon spice. I even begin to pick up like a a rosemary, um, like an infused rosemary herbal type scent on that last third as well. Very very good cigar. So the cigar is going to score pretty good tonight. Uh, on my scale of one to ten. What I've done on my scale now of one to 10, I took a page out of uh, Ryan Reel's book. We was talking about this the other night. I took out the price in the scoring anymore because the, the price really shouldn't determine how the cigar tastes or how it smoke. So I'm gonna eliminate the price out of my score from now on. Um, but on the construction, I gave it a 10. On the burn, the burn has been perfect throughout this cigar the whole way. Beautiful burn. Beautiful burn line. I gave the burn a 10. Flavor, I gave the flavor an eight. I give the body an eight. Complexity and transition, I give it a seven. So on a scale of one to 10, this score, this cigar will score 8.6 for tonight, which makes this Davidoff Zeno back to back Lemon Edition 2019, a top-notch cigar. Great anytime cigar. Um, one of the reasons why I joined the Provider Club was because of the exclusivity of the club. 
knowing that you were going to get your hands on some cigars that uh, you may or may not be able to get your hands on again. This is one I'm going to have to check. I don't think it's available right now anymore. Um, I hope that we can get our hands on some more of these so that I can get a couple of them and put in a box. It's definitely one that I'd like to keep a couple of them in the box if I can get my hands on a couple of more. It may be too late. But it's a beautiful smoking cigar. Um, for those of you guys that have tried it, I've known a few people that have tried it and they seem to be very pleased with the cigar. For those of you guys that have tried it, in the comments let me know uh, how you liked it. But for me, 8.6 for the night. This is Cowboy. It's been a beautiful smoke. That's my take on it. Peace.